It is a rarely understood but prevalent childhood disease believed to affect one in 200 children in this country. Parents say it is like their child changed overnight. This evening, you will meet a local doctor with a personal mission on the cutting edge of treatment and diagnosis. Pam Serrano has the story. This pink bike riding former single mom put herself through medical school and now has her own practice, Family Spectrum in Verona. Children, adults, zero to 100 for all 21 of the diagnoses. Dr. Elizabeth Spar is the only doctor in the area specializing in what's called PANDAS, a childhood onset condition, pediatric autoimmune neuropsychiatric disorders associated with streptococcus, meaning infection after strep throat that can suddenly adversely affect a child's mood or behavior, cause tics, and that's not all. It's not normal if you're going through a phase for your handwriting to deteriorate. It's not normal if you're going through this phase to be getting bad headaches. Dr. Spar says it's the combination of childhood psychiatric issues along with neurological issues that can lead to a PANDAS or PANS diagnosis and can cause brain inflammation. It's now believed other infections other than strep like sinus infections, Lyme, allergies, even exposure to toxins can cause the childhood condition that in severe cases can look like this. And for the mom and doctor, there was a very personal reason why she began the journey to treat pans and pandas, and it started right here at home. Meet two of the four of Dr. Spar's children who have the condition. Max and his older brother had the toughest time. They were seen by 15 doctors before they were diagnosed with pans pandas. This was Max then. And this is him now, playing Chopin on the keyboard and writing his own classical music with his little sister, also diagnosed, dances to accompany him. But it wasn't always this way. I get really sad about the fact that my two older boys lost 10 years of their life. They lost their childhood to this. Dr. Spar says they once had to have a designated room for Max just to keep him safe from the rest of the family. Dr. Spar treats patients like son Max and others diagnosed with PANS PANDAS with an integrative treatment, often antibiotics, vitamins, and sometimes in cases like Max, medical marijuana. Eric Spar, Dr. Spar's husband, says the treatment combined with the tincture of medical marijuana under his tongue or a pill gives him more clarity of thought. It calms him down and makes him less, uh, less ticks. Max isn't the only child seeing a difference. Dr. Spar is getting calls from all over Pittsburgh, the U.S., and even the world to help their kids, too. Because I figured it out that I'm able to help all of these families and um, it really is, it really is amazing work and you, you get a lot of families crying and hugging you because they, they got their kid back.